For anyone working with lots of open documents, most of the time you will find yourself moving your open programs window from one side to the other side, always trying to rearrange their position. While the window splitting tool can help you with the basic, if you want more complex arrangement, I recommend you to install the third-party application. For my workflow, I use Display Fusion. Let me show you how I do it. If you're new for this channel, subscribe. We have a lot of contents here and more coming every week. Hit the bell so you get notification every time I upload a video. This is how I work most of the time. Full size open word document. When I need, I have a reference material on the left side and a word document on the right side. Each application using half size of the laptop screen. Sometimes when I need, I have my web browser using 25% of my screen and the rest with other application. Windows Slips Control screen is limited. You cannot do all of these arrangements and you have to use keyboard shortcuts. With this application, I have all the controls at the top right side of every open window next to the minimize and maximize windows control. We just have to click to rearrange the position. Setting up this application can be confusing for the first time, but I'm here to help you with that. This application has lots of functions. I'm going to focus only on screen management. On the left side of the program, you have functions to manage your screen. You have a lot of options here. Scroll down to find the one you want. Click on it to select, then double click or click on edit to assign a key board shortcut combination. On this window, select Shift, Control or any of these options combined to any other key to create a shortcut. Then click on Toggle title bar to show it on all your program's title bar. Since I have all these functions on my title bar, I have no need to assign the keyboard shortcut. At the bottom, you have a small preview of how it is going to appear. You can see the function that we have just selected next to the minimize control of the window. This is how the function is going to appear on the title bar of every window program. If you like the way it looks, click on apply to see the button on every application title bar, then click OK to close it. Now I'm going to open an application to show you how it works. I've opened here my VLC application and you can see here at the top that the function we have added is right here. Once you click, it's going to rearrange the window to the left side, just like we expect. Sometimes I find these buttons overlapping the program's title bar, but for me, it's a minor issue and I'm okay with that. If none of these functions suits your needs, you can create one. Click on custom function and then add custom function. Give it a name. I'm going to give this split 25%. What I want to create here is a window program that only takes 25% of the screen size. Function action will be manage window, so leave the way it is. Then down here, custom function actions, window screen action, I'll keep the way it is because I'm using just one screen. On window alignment, I want it to move to the left side. I'm going to select move window to the top left side corner. Now here I'm going to change the width and the height. Here you have the option to use percentage or pixel. I use percentages, it's easy. So on window width, click on this menu. I want it to be, I'm going to select width to a specific percentage. So, and I want it to be 25%. I'm gonna write there 25%. And for the height, I'm going to click here and select height with specific percentage. I want it to be 100% and then click OK. And you will see that the function we just have created is going to appear at the custom functions. To have it on the Windows title bar, click on toggle title bar button. 
Since this is the first time, you have to select the image set and icon image for your functions. I'm going to leave the way it is for Windows Arial. And for the icon, I'm going to select the one that I think is going to suit the function. And I think this one represents best what I want to do. And then I'm going to click OK. You can see here at the bottom on this preview, the function that we have created has been added to the title bar. And if you want, you can rearrange the position by click on it and holding and dragging to where you want it to be. If you're okay with that, click on apply and then click OK. Now I'm going to open VLC again and you can see here that we have the split 25% function that we have created. If you click on that, it is going to move our window to the left size and using only 25% of the screen size. And this is exactly what I want it to do. This is a good program if you are constantly rearranging your program screen, especially if you have a widescreen monitor. This program is a little pricey, but I think that the free version is going to be enough for the majority of the people. If you want to experience the pro version, you can download the trial for 30 days and then decide to buy or not. Well guys, that's all for this video. If you find this tutorial helpful, give a like, subscribe to the channel, it will help the channel to grow and will make me happy. Thank you and I'll see you in the next video.